Hey guys, welcome back to Intentionally Nala and today's word is intentional. Intentional means, well intention means aim or plan. In the medical field, intention means the healing or process of a wound. Intentional means done on purpose, deliberate, designed or planned. In the metaphysical realm, it means pertaining to an appearance, phenomenon or representation in the mind or pointing beyond itself as consciousness or a sign. So I have my notes here as usual that I'm gonna to read to you guys. So no one wants to live a meaningless life. I feel like at some point in our lives, we try to find the reason why we're here or our actual purpose. And if we haven't discovered our purpose, I think the next big thing we can do is at least move towards our purpose or even move with purpose. Why are you doing the things you are doing? Just because you haven't discovered the reason for your existence doesn't mean you can't move towards it. Who are you at your core? Do you even know? I ask you that because I hope that if you've come across this video, you've at least discovered yourself in Christ, like you know who you are in Christ, as in recognize that he's your father and that you have an inheritance. If you don't know why you're here, the least you can do is know who God says that you are. And when you know who you are, you can move with the deliberate aim of creating something greater due to the knowledge of who your father is. My father is a king. My father is God. Therefore, I'm his child. I'm his princess to whom supernatural things can happen to, which are miracles. I'm part spirit just as my father is in the spiritual. So in knowing my identity, I can move with ease, with confidence, with purpose that I'm doing the will of my father. Just like Jesus, I'm about my father's business. What are your intentions? They should be about your father's business. What is the purpose in moving with how you move? It needs to be about your father's business. Always representing your father. So move intentionally and in love. Move with purpose, with mercy and with grace. Like what are your intentions? What is your heart truly saying? So we're gonna do a heart check. Time for a heart check. What are your true intentions with um, talking to people, with involving yourself in certain affairs? Is it for your own gain or for the kingdom of God, for your father's business? Examine yourself and examine your heart posture with everything that you do. Be real with yourself. God already sees the thoughts of his children. He made your eyeballs, so how can he not see? The least you can do is be real with yourself and examine your intentions. All right, until next time.